Earlier I published a couple of videos where I shown how can you generate unlimited AI voices and that too absolutely for free. In this video, I will show you another method using which you will be able to generate unlimited AI voices and that too absolutely for free. After generation of these AI voices, you will be able to download those files as an audio file and you can use those files to learn a new subject or you can sell it and earn some money from it. So let me show you the method. So currently I'm in ChatGPT console and here I'll use ChatGPT to generate our text. Let me paste this particular prompt. What am I writing? I'm planning to produce a podcast on the topic job security in generative AI era. Please give me script to generate a 15 minute conversation between two speakers. Give me the entire script in below format. Make it comprehensive and cover both employee and employer aspect. So it will give us tone of the conversation. Then it will give us the speaker one dialogue and then similarly tone of conversation and then it will give us speaker two dialogue. Now this is our prompt. Now I purposefully written this prompt so that I can show you something. After it will generate the content, there will be certain error, so which will handle, but I purposefully kept that error here so that I'll be able to show you how can you generate your text also and you will understand why am I doing it this way. If I hit enter, now it will start generating the content for us. Yeah, here is the comprehensive 15 minutes podcast script for you and ChatGPT started working on it. Now it gave a podcast title, job security in generative AI era, format speaker one and speaker two, duration 15 minutes and now it started generating the entire content. Now, once this will generate, then we will go to our next step. So let it complete the generation of this entire script. So now it generated the entire script. You can see it's mentioning it can download as a PDF also, but we don't need that. So what I'll do, I'll select this entire text from here, speaker one to here. So this is the text we have copied. Now we'll go to our next step. So this one I generated using ChatGPT. You can use any other tool, any LLM model to generate your script because in the similar way, you will be able to use some of the free tool also. Currently, I'm using free tier of ChatGPT. You will also be able to use it. Sometimes ChatGPT can sound a bit robotic. You can use Claude also to generate your script and that's a good alternative whenever you are generating any kind of text. But using any of the LLM model, you can generate your script initially. Now, while we're talking about this part and before we go to the next thing, one small announcement, my ChatGPT course is now available in Skillshare. I have added one link in the description below. If you're interested, you can check it out. They have a trial program. If you don't like the platform, you can cancel it anytime. Now, coming back, now we are going to use another tool so that we'll be able to utilize this particular script. But before that, I would like to show you how ChatGPT sounds if we are using the script in ChatGPT itself and generate the voice. Because here there is one option, read aloud. If I click on it, let's see how it sounds. Welcome back to another episode of Work Reimagined. Today, we're exploring a topic that's on everyone's mind, job security in the generative AI era. Now, this is one part. It is sounding good, but not that convincing. It's a bit flat. The voice is good, but the modulation in this particular way the guy is speaking, that's not that great. Another problem is there. You cannot download that audio from here. You need to follow another method to download that audio. I already published another video covering that way also. But now let me show you the next tool. I'll open a new tab. I'll go to my favorite application that is Google AI Studio. This is one place where I get all my answers. Here, once this is loaded, you'll be able to see this kind of interface. If you're new to Google AI Studio, use your Google credentials to log in. This is absolutely for free. You don't need to pay anything. Now here, one option is there, generate media. If I click on it, then you will be able to see this type of interface. Here, we'll click on Gemini speech generation. And once this is generated, now you can see it is showing you this particular interface. First of all, let us understand we are using Gemini 2.5 flash preview TTS model. Another option is there that is pro preview TTS model. 
So we are going to use the pro one because this is absolutely for free. We don't need to pay anything. So first of all, we have now selected the model. Second is this is a single speaker audio or multi speaker. So we generated script for multi speaker. So it will be multi speaker. Now what we need to do, we already copied this text. So that is already copied. I need to just delete this and I need to paste this entire text here. Next thing what we want to do, we can select that speaker control. First one is name is speaker one. If I want to type that speaker name as John and then I come to voice, there are multiple different options. If you click on the second one and let's hear it that how it sounds. Got a project in mind. So this is one. Ready to make something amazing? Okay, so I'll use this particular option. The third one, Sharon. What do you want to explore? And then I'll come back and the next speaker, I may we type it Elena. Now you can see that error came. No speakers detected. Please ensure your script speaker name are also set in the right sidebar. So we named here speaker one as John, right? But here we mentioned speaker one. Otherwise, what will happen when the conversation will happen, one person will address the other person as speaker one or speaker two. So whenever you are generating your script, then only you can mention your speaker name. So what I will do will come back here. I asked chat GPT, please replace speaker one with John and speaker two with Elena and give me the revised text. So it will generate again and it will give me. So I purposefully kept it so that you will be able to understand there is one requirement inside Google AI Studio. You need to specifically mention that speaker name properly whenever you are assigning that voice. So while it's generating the next voice. Ready to make something amazing? Okay, this is good. So we selected the sound and Elena also we selected the sound. Let's come back to chat GPT to see that our text is also generated. Again, we'll copy, we'll come back here, we'll come to this text box, we'll delete everything, we'll paste it. And this time you can see it picked up properly. The yellow speaker one setting, it is yellow and text is properly picked up from the left pane and then Elena, the color is the purple and there it also picked up. Now we are all ready. What do we need to do? We need to click on run and then it will take some time and then it will start generating that audio. Now one good part is using this audio, you can create a podcast. You can do multiple other things. You just need to write your script here and you can select the required voices. There are multiple different options and you can generate. And once this is generated here, one pop up will come and from there you will be able to download. So now the entire process. So this is for free. Now one thing can happen that is this is Google AI Studio, right? And this is meant for developers to develop their applications and Google may move any of these models anytime. So if you have any requirement to generate certain AI voices, do it quickly because any day Google can move those things because Google recently released our loads of AI related announcement and they announced some of the new capabilities, new models. So they may change certain things in Google AI Studio soon. Also, whenever you will be maybe watching this video, if you see any changes and maybe the UI is not matching with mine and yours, it can happen. You may just need to check and find out where are the exact options are available. There is another option. You can also contact me one to one. I have added one link of fan call application in my video description. Using that application, you will be able to schedule one to one discussion with me. If you have any requirement, you want to know anything or you just want to say hello. So that's possible using that app. I'll add the link in the description below. You can use it if you have any such requirement. So this is now ready and now you can see there is one new pop up came here. I can play and I can also click on these three dots and I can download. Let me click on download before it disappears. And if I now click on this play, then let's hear it. How it's sounding. Welcome back to another episode of Work Reimagined. Today we're exploring a topic that's on everyone's mind. Job security in the generative AI era. Is AI here to replace us or help us? Let's unpack that. Absolutely. The last couple of years have brought huge changes. 
with tools like ChatGPT, MidJourney, and Copilot becoming mainstream, many professionals, from writers to coders to customer support agents, are feeling a bit unsure about their future. How is it? Isn't it surprising? The way it generated, very few people will be able to recognize its AI generated. It can generate this kind of a quality. All those voice modulations or maybe way of their speaking, everything is excellent. So this is one free way using which you will be able to generate unlimited AI voices and that too for free. You can start your own podcast channel also. Google AI Studio is a gold mine. And I recorded multiple videos covering different aspects of Google AI Studio and how can we use all these freely available models to produce certain things. Check out this video where I covered another way how can you use Google AI Studio to edit your photos and use it for product photography.